What's going on guys, it's your boy Worthy Prince coming at ya with another Lords Mobile video and in this video we're going to be taking a look at a new update that's coming to Lords Mobile in the next day or two. Now a lot of you guys are always asking for free stuff, especially the free to play players out there of course. I mean, IGG have been listening of late, I mean hello, they gave us a couple of free to, uh, pay to play heroes recently, but now we've got login gifts. I actually like the picture on the front of it, it kind of reminds me of Pac-Man, can you see Pac-Man down there chomping on the squares? <laughs> it was quite funny, um, but yeah you can see mine's got 29 days so it was a 30 day uh, login gift I've got here so I can log in daily for 30 days and I can pick myself up a free prize every day I log in. And this is pretty good, I mean I have seen these vary, I've seen some with 21, some with 14 and the gifts do vary as well on the free to play side which you can see is login gifts, okay? I've seen chests, I've seen hero medals, I've seen lots of cool prizes in here guys. So like I say, every day you log in, you hit the claim button at the top there, it tells you what time every day it will reset, okay? Um, and then you go off and you press the button and get your daily reward and you can see today's gift I've got some gold, which is pretty cool, I mean, who wants 200,000 free gold? I I'll take that. Got some speed ups, got some speed boots, some research speeds, I made it 10-15 minutes, I mean it doesn't sound like a lot, but all this stuff's going to add up. There's resources there, there's EXP to boost your hero. Most importantly guys, this is really good for a startup account, you know, for new players coming to Lords Mobile. You know, I wish I had this stuff when I first started, I didn't have any of this, if I wanted these brave hearts, I had to go and buy them. You know, the fact that the game's giving them away for free, it's quite nice, okay? And their wing boots level 1, okay, you know. Let's go down and take a look at all this stuff. So we've got some chests, we've got some wing boots too. Alright! Got ourselves an emote stamp. That's always nice to give someone an emoji. It only goes down to 21. I'm guessing it only goes up to 21. Like, you can only see up to 21, but I reckon it probably goes lower. Possibly, or it gives you extra time, an extra seven days, is it, I think, or eight days to go ahead and claim the rest. But I've got a feeling as you get down to 21, more will appear underneath. Okay, take a look at this as well. This is quite interesting. You can see some of the ones on the left have got like a yellow halo around them. And then in the other side, they've got some of some of them have got yellow halos or yellow rings around them as well, glowing. I don't know what that means. I don't know whether it means you get a bonus, or maybe if you get that one, you can have the one on the right hand side. I don't know. There's chests there as well, which is pretty cool. Now you can see the unlock one pound ninety nine or one dollar ninety nine. That's the like I said. There's a pay to play twist. That's the twist element to it. If you want to access these bonus gifts. You have to pay $1.99. Now the good news I can confirm to you is you don't have to pay $1.99 per row. $1.99 unlocks it all, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and claim my gold. So there you go, 200,000 gold. Thank you very much. I will return tomorrow for my Braveheart. Thank you so much. So, I mean, what can we say, guys? What do you think? I mean, I give IGG props for putting this in. I think it's really cool. So regarding the $1.99 thing, Let's go back to that. Now, let's just say, for example, you do want some of the stuff on the right-hand side. You, you want those bonus items. I mean, looking at them, okay, they're not amazing, but just look. It says, unlock bonus gifts to get more rewards. You'll get all bonus gifts for the days you've previously logged in for. Now, what that means, in case you don't quite get that, is let's say, for example, I'm playing this and I'm not bothering to buy it, okay? I get all the way down to like day 20 or day 21 and I see something in the bonus side that I really really want. I really really want it. You know, it could be anything guys, it could be some speed ups that I need, it could be those research boosts, maybe I'm going to do a massive research and I want a research boost. I'm at day 15, I want that research boost. If I go ahead and pay $1.99, not only am I going to get my research boost, but I'm going to unlock all the items before that, okay? so. It might even be worthwhile not paying for that straight away. You know, just 
keep doing the free to play stuff until you almost get to the end and then just evaluate how many days you actually did click because the last thing you want to do is pay two pounds or two dollars and then miss out on a bunch of stuff because you haven't logged in which is in all fairness guys you should be logging in daily like i'm just <laughs> i'm just saying but that's my advice i would literally go to the almost the end of it then take a look at your bonus items and just work out if you feel it's worth the two dollars or two pounds um but yeah that's how that works so again it doesn't do each row for two quid it's basically the whole thing unlocks for 199 i don't know whether the price will change if the items get better i mean i don't know anyway guys that's the update so let me know what you think in the comments if you haven't already subscribed make sure you do that smash that like button and what's the next part oh yeah you know how this next bit goes <laughs> stay safe everybody and peace out